We've heard the expression that that person is full of ambition. I want to talk about that word ambition because sometimes it's used in a negative way. That expression I just gave you, for example, is a negative expression. All the time. Well, they're full of ambition, which may mean that they um, run over people. They don't care what people think. They, they're, they're pretty much into themselves and wanting to succeed themselves. So it, it can be used in a negative term, but I want to give it to you in a positive way, and that is the fact that if we have ambition, it causes us to want to do better and, and to to grow more and to exceed ex- expectations. And I think that's a positive thing. So I think the question is, what am I ambitious for? If I'm ambitious just for myself, I'm full of ambition, and probably it's a negative term. But what happens if I'm ambitious for others also? In other words, I'm your greatest cheerleader, and I'm as ambitious for you to succeed as I am for me to succeed. I think that's a healthy ambition that I can have for you and that I can have for myself. So ask yourself today, as you finish Minute with Maxwell, who am I ambitious for? Who do I want to see in my family or my friendships that I really want them to succeed well? And what am I doing to help them maybe fulfill that ambition that they have in their life? I'm glad you're with me today. 